Hello. Hope you're doing well. I really enjoyed seeing your video about Ushmal. And the jaguar was so cute. I just wanted to keep it. As a matter of fact, um, if you wanted to bring me a jaguar, I, I don't think I'd be opposed. S sit on it. Think it over. Um, everything's going well here. This is me after blood donation. I didn't really get a good video of that, and she wouldn't let me, like, record as she was, like, sticking the needle into my arm. Which, while I'm a little disappointed, is probably for the best. <laughs> now that I really think that through. Yeah, and then I kept, like, getting a bunch of other people in the video, and it just, it wasn't working well. So there's no good video of that. I apologize. I will try better next time. Try harder? Try better? I don't know, whatever the expression is. Um... But no, that was pretty fun. I strongly encourage everyone to donate blood at least once. Um, yeah, it's a little uncomfortable sometimes, but the people who are receiving your blood tend to be a whole hell of a lot more uncomfortable than you are in, you know, the hour it takes to donate. Actually, this was like the quickest blood donation ever. I swear, she got the needle in my arm and like two minutes later I was done. Not literally, because I think that would kill me, but, but it felt like that. Not the killing part, but the quick part. It felt quick. Um... Yeah. Super nice lady. She didn't bruise me, which was really awesome. Normally they're like, oh, let me jab you a million times and you'll bruise. But no, not this time. She was pretty good. Um, it was fun, exciting. Um, yeah. I'm not actually feeling the best, in all honesty. But that's okay. Still worth it. Still worth it. Um, I keep saying um a lot. Sorry. It's very inarticulate of me. Oops. Anyway, nothing really new to report here. Um, damn it, I did it again. <sighs> Disappointed in me. But uh, things are going pretty well. I'm excited. I don't know why. Oh, and I have to go pick up um, people from the bus stop tonight. And hopefully I can remember that because they'd be pretty irritated if I left them stranded. Although it'd be kind of funny. Like... <laughs> I shouldn't laugh at that. That's not nice. Oh, speaking of not nice, I ran into the sidewalk smiler guy. The one who keeps smiling, like, when my scarf is, you know, in the way. Like, stop smiling at people who can't smile back. Like, holy hell. Ugh. I mean, well, keep smiling at people. That's really nice. But make sure they can smile back. Because I feel really bad every time. I'm like, you are going out of your way to smile. Ooh, there's my band-aid. But, uh... It just, it makes me so sad. Oh, and the other thing that makes me really sad. So I was telling a story this morning because I got asked about Gotham. I just finis finished the first season. Super good. If you want a show that's going to rip out your feels, watch that. But I was, like, talking about it or whatever, and apparently I got a little animated, and Megan counted, like, 16 Taylorisms. You know, I still don't believe they're a thing. I don't have Taylorisms, but uh, if I did, she would have counted sixteen of them within like a seven-minute period. I figured you'd want to know that because you're on the tirade of people who you're on the tirade. You're on the parade. You joined the parade of people who think that. You joined the wagon of people who think. I don't know. There's an expression in there somewhere. Yeah, you jumped on the wagon of people who think like you. Right? Right? No, maybe not. Anywho, I've got to get going. Have fun. I look forward to seeing your video. Bye.